Okay, nine, now it's time to take a look at the sanctions from LMC on Canopillas, Katsina United and Ramsters. Now, Rotimi, I mean, we March the 18th was spectacular, you know, away victory, goalless, you know, from home and all that, some spectacular games in Lagos and everywhere. But then uh, Katsina fans and, you know, the ones in Kaduna, Kano decided to just make it very, very awful for everyone. And LMC have decided to come up with that, their sledgehammer, so to speak, or steel hammer, or whatever you want to call it. <coughs> for Canopy Pillars, we'll start with that fine of a total of 7.25 million naira. Mm. Now, there you have it. Canopy Pillars were fined 7.25 million naira, as well as other consequential fines and closure of stadium to fans until further notice. The club has also been directed to identify and hand over to the police for prosecution its match security stewards who led the attack. This is not good. Security stewards that you feel should protect the fans. He led <laughs> the attack on match officials during the match day 18 fixture against Aqua United. You lose, you lose, you stay there. For Katina United, they were fined, fined a total of 2.5 million, naira, which included 500,000 as compensation to Imba International and the cost to be determined for repair of their damaged vehicle. The club is also to pay to play the next three home matches behind closed doors, two of which is suspended for a probationary period till mm. end of the season and a suspended sanction of three point deduction. I think this is enough. Then for Remasters, the LMC imposed a cumulative fine of 2.5 million, a restriction of fans from attending three home matches with the last two suspended and also a suspended three-point deduction for the remaining matches of the season. So if it happens again, they'll get three-point deducted. But the thing is, it's just one. Amber's goalkeeper, Fatal Daudo, was suspended for one match only and fined 50,000 naira for aggression towards his, a ball boy during the match against Christina United. Just a little bit of them for Rabi Ali at uh, uh, Montella. And Motala Adamo of Canopillas, they were also sanctioned for threatening of the referee and conducted themselves in a manner that was capable of inciting others to commit violence or misconduct and consequently suspended for one match. Not good. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm mean, in deep breath now. Oh, I mean, do you think all the sanctions are enough? Um, personally, I think uh, it's just a slap on the wrist. Really? <laughs> you know, for most of these uh, teams. Now, to start with the fines, the fines are not going to be paid by the clubs. Why? It's going to be deducted. From the money from, accrued to them at the end yeah, of the season. Yeah, from the money accrued to them at the end of the season. Okay. That's not painful enough. Okay. And then you said um, suspended, um, suspended yeah, home games. Why, games. why suspended home games? Why not just have three games back to back? You know, we doubt fans coming on, uh, coming into play because but at this point, rule. I think it's a rule. They can change. That's it. the. Quote, I was going to go back the, to the, the rules you know, of the LMC statutes, point um, eighteen and C one and all. I that. think that that that, that, that statute to. has to be looked into again mm. and then reviewed so, because hey, it can it, it can't be edited, N not until we get a referee killed mm. or one of the players, you know, seriously assaulted injured. or seriously injured from yeah. all of this, and then we now decide to go back or to the, the fans. rules or the fans. I yeah. mean, if. Take for instance what happened in Shagamu. It was the journalist that were, the, the journalist that was attacked actually said because he's a he's a friend. He said the media officer of the particular club was there telling them, yes, this is him. Hmm. Wipe out your phone and all that. Uh, I mean, wipe off uh, whatever you've recorded from your phone. Uh, on, on, oh. uh, unless you do that, we won't give you back the phone. You keep beating you. So it's like a. Now, where is that media officer? I mean, we didn't see anything here. It, it was in the uh, it, it was in the, it, they said um, Ramos stars you know should should uh, pay a cost uh, yeah. no, 750,000 for failing to ensure restriction to, yeah, to, uh, that, that was, I saw that as part of yeah. the rules the, the, I'm saying the media officer that was there you know that kind of uh, how do I oversee no they, they didn't get that story they didn't get the story. It was from the uh, victim, no? Okay, that was... They, they didn't get all that. I mean, the story is... Well, LMC got. should have called the, the, the media officer in question. And it was because that people. thing went viral on social media. And that's so that's what LMC happened. is acting on. Mm. Okay. They didn't probably bother, you know, to go further to investigate, investigate what actually went on. Because, unfortunately, it wasn't only the journalist that was meant to be attacked. All the journalists that were there were also meant to be attacked, but somehow... Um, the crisis was um, managed. quickly managed just because that guy had cameras. So maybe uh, that's why it was the main coup, uh, main victim or mm -hmm. something in court. But, I mean, all of this are just there for LMC to act on. But if you have a statute that tells you what you can do is just to um, pay fines 
have suspended the home game sentences Deduction and all that. Points and he, all does, that. he doesn't do anything. But if you do it If you tell them, if for instance, a Rotimi FC uh, misbehaves at home, and then uh, like um, that on Sabri scene we saw at, at Cannes over the weekend, mm. it's very simple. Deduct like three, six points. I wouldn't do it again. <laughs> it's very simple because if, if you tell them, <laughs> the don't LMC worry, if when you do it again, they will the now rules. remove three points. It doesn't change anything. Mm. It's still, I mean, look at the case of Fatal Dauda. Yes, it was, it was aggression. And then I saw the funny hospital that the, the ball boy was in there. We don't have <laughs> to talk about that. That's another. Yeah. But that's not enough reason for Katina United officials and probably fans, fans, you know, to go out there and then start attacking the Imba boss. So, so, so you, you've um, suggested a points and deduction. What other measures, I mean, can could a, uh, LMC actually, you know, Bef Ty, be between, think, between you and I, I think. Point deduction is very crucial to anything. Yeah, which, if you tell them, yes, you can tell them, oh, play your next three home games behind closed doors, but not suspended. Okay. You I, are I, still I, like I pampering them. them. Just the yeah, but that's just to deter them from committing, you know, the, he's, he's saying um, that it's not enough. It's not what enough. LMC needs to do is to take a look at these rules, uh, you know, see how they can and amend then, it. Yeah. Amend these rules. Amend these rules. But, but, Maybe but then again, someone the said... Maybe sanction heavier when it involves fans, that's the only way you can deter them because this is not enough Before deterrent. the start of the season, I'm sure there's this uh, meeting or forum they normally have, club bonus, oh, administrators and all okay. that. Yeah. So do you think this wasn't yeah. agreed. I mean, what we are clamoring for wasn't, wasn't agreed. That's so the problem. if so I come how? to a CCFC, for instance, and say, I'm deducting you three points for violence, you can actually charge me to court. Yes, because tell, it's not here. So, so, so what you're saying, they need to amend this rule. That's what he's saying. They need to take a look at this rule yes. and amend it. Because if you, ha if you have, imagine the opening game of the season, fine, but I'm I mean, abandon and I mean, all that. I mean, the, the rule wasn't strict enough, you know, according to most people. So they're thinking, if this, uh, these things keep happening, beating up of referees, you know, fans misbehaving and all that, birds being destroyed and all, and players taking laws into their hands and everything, then you need to include more stiffer sanctions to deter these players and I, fans. I totally from, get you know, what you're saying. Uh, going Ruth, what you're saying, I totally get what you're saying as well. So what I'm saying is, do you think really uh, these club owners in quotes would agree to those kind of sanctions <laughs> at, the, at the start of the season? Obviously, the LMC have to carry then, them then along. That, then that means we're still joking. <laughs> yes, that That's means the Nigerian point. Professional Football League is still a joke if we have to wait for the, the club owners or club, uh, club administrators the, to have to have to accept. Whatever the governing body in court now, you know, wants to bring into the game, we have to send a strong message. We have yes. to, we have to send, okay. and, and it has to start with a traditional team, not just um, okay. one, okay. one, one mino, you know, somewhere. Okay, traditional okay. team like Canapillas. Okay, enough of the LMC now. We'll move straight to UEFA Champions League. We know what happened last night. Yes, not good.